Well, boxing legend Mike Tyson has had many highs and lows in his life and career. He's ready to share it all with you in his stage show, Mike Tyson Undisputed Truth. Our own Megan is with him live to find out more. Hi there, Megan. Hello there. Guess what, ladies? His favorite candy, orange starburst. This is true. How this many true. have you eaten today, Mike? Well, um, unfortunately, I only had two, but perhaps when the camera goes off, I can have the one that's on the table. Okay, are you going to keep these next to you when you're on stage at MGM for Mike Tyson Undisputed no, Truth? No, that'd be Jolly Ranchers. What flavor? I like apple. I like the new raspberry they have, but of course, you know, cherries supreme. Yes, Cherry Supreme. Okay. Cherry well, look, let's talk about your Supreme show. You're coming back, but Mike Tyson Undisputed Truth kicked back in 2012. Kicked, yes. kicked off in 2012, rather. Hit HBO, hit Broadway. Why bring it back to Vegas now? Because um, this is the man for Vegas. This is where it starts at, and this is where it's going to finish at. You know, we went all over the world. We did it in, where we did it in Spain. We did it in Brussels. We did it in Monte Carlo. We did it. Oh, man. Well, listen, we did it quite a few. We did it everywhere. Places, right? <laughs> Australia. But the fact is that um, it started here in Las Vegas. It should awesome have, awesomely, awesomely have a second run. And I'm looking forward to it. My friends are coming down. My family are going to be here. And it's going to be awesome. I'm going to be working with my wife. And hopefully we don't get in any more arguments while we're performing. <laughs> but, you know, that's just part of the business. So your wife, Kiki, I hear she had a playing part in writing the script for no, this. Is this true? Script. She wrote the script. Really? Were you nervous when she put it in front of you? Like, oh, is this too much? No, um, I was nervous, but I never had any doubt. I knew I could do it, but I knew it would be torture. Yeah. Okay, so what can we expect for someone who's maybe never heard of it, never seen the HBO special, didn't catch it on Broadway, didn't catch it in its first run? What are people going to get from Mike Tyson, Undisputed Truth? All right, for anybody that's um, in the planetary human being, a creature that never saw this show, and this is a roller coaster of emotions. You're going to be crying, you're going to be ambiguous, you're going to be angry, happy, and it's just, man, listen, trust me, um, this is just a wonderful show. I've got rants, raves, reviews, and you can just check for yourself and check the ratings. I'm just very proud of the show. Really, yeah. I am. Well, for you, I mean, you, you've told the story before on stage in Las Vegas. So what new are you bringing? Is it going to well, be about stuff you've done since 2012? Well, no, I'm, it's going to be some new stuff. But the fact is that it's, it's, I do a different show every night. The, I'm the crowd act for a different show, different people. So you don't do it the same way every night. Yeah. You're a quintessential performer at the end of the day, right? From your storied career in boxing. Are you going to take the same path you took into MGM to get to the stage we are going to? Does, do those memories, are those important enough no, for you to take that same path? No. no. Um, um, the most, um, what I think the most lowest form of language in, in American languages was, and I never was. Anything I'm doing, I'm doing now. Whatever happened in the back, and that's where it's staying. So this is all new. This is all new. This is now. Let's talk about some upcoming projects. Let's talk about Absolutely. the future. Absolutely. Meet the Blacks. What's that well, about? Meet the Blacks is um, a movie that I did with Michael Epps. He invited me to come down there. We also had Tiny, T.I.'s wife. Tiny is also oh, with cool. Tiny Harrison. It's an um, array of little stars in the movie that people are familiar with. And I play, I don't know what I am. I could be a... I could be a transgender eunuch. I don't know what I am, but I, I'm a guy that I don't know what I am. I, but it looks like that. I got the long perm, I got the bald head, and I, I don't know what I am. You don't know, but we're meeting good. the blacks, and we're going to have good. fun. It looks really good. Yeah. Okay. It looks good. All right, so March 3rd, that is a week from today, next yes. Thursday, yes. you kick off Mike Tyson Undisputed Truth Undisputed right Truth. here yes. in Las Vegas. And it's going through June? Yes, June 26th. That June 26th. Yes. All right, my friends, we're going to send it back to you in the studio. Right. So. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. How cool to be hanging out yeah. with Mike Tyson in the afternoon. Yes, mm -hmm. and it's so cool to see him back. And you have a story. Yes. I'm, a personal brush up First time I actually saw him in person, I was trying to sneak into the Texas station for a matinee, <laughs> and he was coming out. And he just walked right up to me and goes, hi, Ricky. And they kept walking. <laughs> and I was just like, hi, Mike. <laughs> he was sneaking happen? out, and you yeah. were sneaking in. Right. I thought, and both of us, that's really sad. But I thought, he knows who I am. Oh. It's fantastic. That's so cool. I that would love so that. Cool. Yeah, we'll see if we could get him to come and co-host on that the show. That would be too. so much fun. Yeah, all right. Well, trending right now.